For this stretch, I'm going to be using a yoga mat, but you can choose to use a towel or on the bare floor at home. For the hamstring stretch, I'm going to be stretching my left hamstrings as an example for this video. You are going to be putting your left leg straight 45 degrees from your body with your right leg bent in either next to the knee or next to the thigh. Please do not place your ankles on the knee itself. Make sure that they are off the knee on the floor. When you are ready, put your hands together, overlapping them at the middle finger, reaching forward, slowly reaching as far as you can go. If you cannot touch your toes, don't worry. Place your hands either on your shin, above the ankles, also possible. If you can, of course, please touch your toes and hold this position for 10 to 15 seconds. Once done, relax and change for the other side. You can repeat about three to five sets of this stretch. It is important to note that when you're doing this stretch, please do not have a sudden jerking action going down, rather slowly adjust into the position so that you can feel how intense the stretch can get. In the video, I mentioned that the ankles should not be placed on the knees. The reason being, Having your ankles on your knee as you're doing this stretch can place excessive hyperextension on the knee joint itself, adding more stress to it. In order to ensure a certain level of comfort, it is advised that your leg is on the floor instead, either next to your knee or next to your thigh. You may observe that in some spots, some athletes may actually do this variation of the stretch, but please be reminded that these are professional athletes or they are individuals that have been doing the exercise for many years. So for them, it may be possible or it may just be a habit. So please, for your safety, for now, do not do the variation with the ankles on the knee joint first.